All right, coming up next, it's a flyweight matchup between TJ Dillashaw and TJ Dillashaw. I mean, volumes, but he's not wasting anything. He's so accurate out there. Nice punch, Lynn. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Oh, nice combination of strikes there in terms of the accuracy. I mean, that's exactly what a coach is looking for. That's exactly. It's like the guy is hitting pads. It's like he's hitting focus mitts, but instead, he's dancing all over his opponent's face. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for TJ Dillashaw. Dillashaw gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Look at the angle of that nice body. Yeah, he mixed it all up. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Well, this striker knows one direction. That is forward. He knows one style. That is aggressive. And that's exactly what we've seen tonight. He has every intent of overwhelming every guy he steps into the octagon with. And he's doing that up to this point of the first round. Nice one-two there. He's throwing every part of himself into like the it's big, like Just like he threw it up with us on Thursday. Catches the kick, counters beautifully with the takedown. He did a great job countering with that nice takedown. Great fight IQ, seeing that kick coming and turning it into his offense. Pretty good knee to the body by Dillashaw. Nice. Oh, you can hear the thwack from here as he lands another leg kick in DC. Now we're seeing visible damage as that leg starts to redden up. And now you start to see the damage. And now you start to see the limping of the opponent. Watch as he gets kicked in the leg, he's turning away. He can't even get any pressure on his front leg anymore. He is beat up. That leg has been tenderized by this young man. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Nice defense there. Huge block. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this? Right with my face. A lot of tremendous striking action in that last round, DC. I know you don't have a Telestrator, but take us through the replay. I mean, I would love to have my Telestrator right now. That was a great display of high-level mixed martial arts striking. Both combatants stood toe-to-toe -to -toe and let it all hang out. All right, here we go with round two. Round one, pretty good, not great, but some action on both sides. We can't always hope for fireworks, John. Yeah. Sometimes you gotta deal with the ebbs and flows of a fight. In round number one, you saw both guys have success. Let's see who really charges out ahead in the second round. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. He's looking for that left hand, not there. Dillashaw's got the tie clinch. Let's see what he can do with it. Oh! Massive kick to the head. Oh, straight right. Look at how he turns his 
hip over when he throws that kick. Throwing that jab, no good. Big call for land. Now he gets back to range. Now connects with a right. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure it doesn't land. 72 total strikes have now landed for TJ Dillashaw. Well, misses on 60% of the strikes, landing with just 40% accuracy against TJ Dillashaw. That's hard to do. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. That's a big strike right there. Ooh. Oh! Dillashaw's inner thigh starting to bruise up pretty good now. Oh, big left hook there! Got to whip his hip into that kick. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Nice punch by Dillashaw. He comes forward with a flying knee that just missed hitting the target flush. Nice job to raise the guard and block another strike there. He doesn't. Oh. Back and forth we go. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more defensively, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. Nice strike. Dillashaw going for the body. Missed with that kick. Oh! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, no! Combinations here. Well, that's the end of the round, so the location is okay, the cut on the cheek, but that is some serious blood. All right, next round is now underway. Previous round, not necessarily a tough act to follow. Pretty good, not great. Pretty good round, but not the best round. Sometimes that's what you get when you have fighters that are so evenly matched. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Just unable to quite find that range. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes him stop throwing. Nice kick there by Dillashaw. And he landed the right hand there. Just misses there with the left. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. All right, getting late in the fight. It has been all action to this point. Right up the gut, DC. He's in a world of trouble now. They say the straight moves are the ones that get there first, and it got right to the target. So 110 total strikes and counting have landed for the great T.J. Dillashaw. Well, more often than not, D.C., it's been a swing and a miss, landing with just a 27% accuracy thus far against T.J. Dillashaw. Great punch. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. Back to the feet. Dillashaw's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. Nice straight right, Lance. Nice kick. Dillashaw's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Oh, he's hurt. Powerful leg 
kick land. Hook shot attempt to the head here. Instead, it's blocked by Dillashaw. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. 45 seconds remain in the round. seconds to go here in our third and final round. Oh. He's hurt bad. Well, he's able to get back up here, but oh, man, is he on wobbly legs. Oh, he got him hurt bad. What a fight. All right, so the fighters go the distance here tonight, but it went a whole lot better for one of them than the other. Talk us through the replays, champ. Some decisions are different than others, and his striking really did separate him from the competition. He fought so well in the stand-up game that he should get a very easy decision. All right, it looks like the official decision is in. Yes, here's Bruce Buffett. 